uh, oculoplasty is plastic surgeries around the eyes that is uh, the structure surrounding the eyes like the eyelids the forehead the eyebrows and the lower face basically oculoplastic surgeons are ophthalmologists that is they are eye doctors who have special training in plastic surgeries so that dual experience helps you know because as ophthalmologists they are used to using microscopes smaller incisions smaller suture size so very fine surgeries can be done so this helps in plastic surgeries around the eyes so most common procedures that are covered in oculoplasty is uh, surgeries on the eyelids like on this eyelid if you have a droopy eyelid or in turning or out turning of the lid margin or if you have a defect or uh, you know if you have a tumor we remove the tumor we reconstruct the entire eyelid so that it looks and functions normally so eyelid surgeries then we have lacrimal surgeries that is uh, tear drainage pathway whenever there is a problem with that oculoplastic surgeons uh, treat that and also uh, diseases of the orbit orbit is the bony framework around the eye so um, whatever tumors that are uh, you know they uh, whatever tumors that uh, occur behind the eyeball or around the eyeball are also treated by oculoplastic surgeons also fractures of the bones which are around the eye uh, they are best treated by oculoplastic surgeons because many of these fractures will involve the muscles of the eye and also the of as ophthalmologists they are used to treating um, you know uh, tissues around the eye so they are best suited to treat the fractures also around the eye and a major part of oculoplasty involves aesthetic procedures like we do botox fillers you know though they are non surgical procedures uh, they are best done by surgeons who know the anatomy in that area who are used to tre treating that area so that they can do it in a safe manner for the patients also you know uh, brow droop we we do a brow lifts blepharoplasties mid face lifts these are some of the aesthetic procedures that are done by oculoplastic surgeons yeah so it all depends on the condition we have injections you know some of the conditions can be treated by medications and some require surgery the commonest injections that we use is botox and fillers so botox is used for facial wrinkles that when you have frown lines or if you have a smile line or if you want to lift the eyebrow non surgically botox is a good option and fillers are usually used to redistribute the fat and contour the face basically under eye hollows etc can be treated by fillers many of the conditions in oculoplasty like inflammations infections some of the tumors we can treat with medications and quite a bit of uh, our work involves surgery so eligibility also depends on the type of treatment so when we talk about botox fillers anybody above 18 can be a candidate for the same like some of the people have dark circles at a very uh, young age and they can go ahead with fillers and some people need a brow elevation also at an earlier age so there is no specific age for these injections and definitely the procedures get safer if it is done by an experienced surgeon in a safe environment like in the hospital we find botox fillers getting done in so many other places i feel hospital setup is easier because you have trained medical staff to you know take care of any adverse events